We're standing by for the White House briefing. We'll bring that to you any moment as the outrage grows over children being taken from their parents as they cross the border. Today we're getting a closer look at the people caring for many of these children who were separated from their undocumented immigrant parents. A company contracted out by the government called Southwest Key. It operates more than two dozen immigrant children shelters in Texas, Arizona, and California. Actually, it's called Hacienda del Sol, people. Okay? Hacienda del Sol. It's one of the largest such providers in the U.S. Among the qualifications for a full-time seasonal youth care worker at one of its locations, applicants must be at least 21 years old, have a high school diploma or GED, and be computer literate. And what struck us when we were doing the research into this company is the company's disclosure of the possible physical demands. Applicants must be, quote, able to respond with appropriate protocol in a variety of dynamic supervision situations with clients of 0 to 17 years of age. Again, 0 to 17 years old. Those are children possibly traumatized after spending days, weeks, even months without their parents and now in the care of complete strangers. The Southwest Key job description goes on to read, and listen to this, quote, in a sudden or emergency event, staff must be at all times physically able to run, jump, lunge, twist, push, pull, apply Southwest Key approved restraint techniques, and otherwise manage or coerce the full weight of an adolescent. While it is uncommon, all staff must be physically and mentally able to manage youth who become uncooperative. Okay, this is all, I think, a PR stunt. I don't think this is in the job description. This is, this is bullshit. Sick. Violent. It's bullshit. It's PR. Public relations. Or display any other form of harmful or threatening behavior. Southwest Key says its training policy requires employees to undergo a minimum of 80 hours of classroom and on-the-job training before they can supervise a child. But we read a story uh, about a former Southwest Key employee in Arizona, a whistleblower. He spoke to the Los Angeles Times, and the Times says this whistleblower described the facility as, quote, unequipped to deal with children. Okay, and this person who's a whistleblower is probably, you know, another um, paid gang stalker, okay? Experiencing trauma. Children were running away, screaming, throwing furniture, and attempting suicide. Okay, that's all a fucking lie. That's, um... That is a massive PR move from this so-called whistleblower. Massive. Okay, so here. I've gone over this video already. I told you Great. it's a... CNN correspondent Nick Valencia. He's in El Paso, Texas for us. And Nick, what do you think are some of the big questions Congress is likely to investigate? Felipe Gomez Alonzo was showing blah, blah, blah. signs okay, of this the isn't the video. All right. So, like I said, this is all staged, people. It's all staged. Okay? Look, let's go over it again. Here, let's go over this again. Okay, the guy walks in with the kid, okay. You know, yeah, it's wrong to touch a child, but the kid slaps him back. Okay? The guy's like, okay, you know, <clears throat> backing off. And then what he does is he hands them off. He hands them off. And watch how the kid walks. That is a confident kid. Okay? Confident. Okay, so let's get into uh, lizard news. Okay, like I said, <clears throat> the wall is a um, optical illusion. They have jump room technology. Okay, and the drugs are still gonna come through. It's not gonna stop you anything. Okay, this here, I looked into it. Um, uh, this one right here, Mysterious Red Sphere. I looked into this. This is probably A, a drone, B, a hologram, or it's the Sun Simulator. Okay? It's the Swiss Templars again. OK, 
Okay, well, if someone's really threatening your life, I suggest highly that you um, man up. Start carrying a weapon. If this is the shit that's being rolled out, start manning up. Don't want to hear your whining and your belly aching that you're not able to protect yourself. It's right there in the Constitution that you have every right to defend yourself to life, you know, life, liberty, and pursuit of happiness. So if someone's giving you death threats, start fucking carrying, conceal and carry. Who gives a fuck? No one on the planet has a right to fuck with your life. Okay? So fucking man up. These fuckers want to, if these fucking reptilian Swiss pieces of shit want to fuck with your life, start carrying weapons, people. Yeah, they want to fucking play, uh, you know, the dance. We'll play the fucking dance. Them and their secret fucking bullshit technology. Ooh, Bernie, feel the burn. Okay, this fucking exorcism shit, this is all remote neural monitoring. This is, uh, like I said, if they know uh, your frequency, they can send directed energy weapons to you. Okay, DARPA has control of this shit. DARPA, fucking wake up, people. All this is bullshit. To get you to down on your knees to suck someone's dick. Fuck them. Look, they make money off of this shit. Suicide prevention. This is all DARPA. Remote neural monitoring. When the fuck are you people going to wake up? Let's get a grip. Secret technology held by the Swiss Templars, which are the reptilian elite. Your fucking uh, Swiss, uh, your fucking uh, royals. Get a grip, people. It's remote neural monitoring. It's all horse shit to get you to consent and bow down to their fucking technology. So they have access to your minds, access to your DNA, access to access, access. It's all fucking bullshit with these lizards. Look, fucking the church knows all about this shit. Okay? You know, Scientology, that's another thing for the Swiss Templars. It's another cult. It's another fucking cult thing, people. You sign up with this shit, they're gonna fucking come after you. Anyways. Look. It's all secret technology. All the world leaders around the globe know all fucking about this shit. Okay? All of them. The secret is in the sauce. The sauce is this. Chemtrails go to your central nervous system. Once they have your DNA frequency, they can send directed energy weapons from the fucking sun simulator into your home, and then they can torment you. It's called directed energy weapons, people. Remote neural monitoring, and they want to do their goddamn Bible code shit. Ah, someone's going to save me. Ah, the fucking earth is going to fall apart. No, it's not, people. It's a fucking charade. I saw a movie last night called 2038, Origin Unknown. And guess what? It was just Skynet. Self-aware AI system blows out humanity, but only takes a few humans with it. You know who AI is, right? It's fucking Lucifer. So, you know. I told you how this shit is, man. We're not fucking getting it through your brain. Like I said, if you're under assault and you're under threat, you know, just... You're gonna have to man up. Carry some fucking weapons. Someone wants to pull some shit, just fucking go for it. You have every right, if you are physically, physically, physically assaulted by these fucking...
fucking goddamn satanic fucks. You have every right to defend yourself. Fuck them. You gotta keep your eye on her. She's getting paid by fucking Bernie how to roll it out. What, yeah. She's probably getting backy, backing from Bernie and fucking, uh, you know, the Clintons or something. So it's all bullshit, people. All of it. From the migrant video to fucking Grijalva uh, to fucking Lindsey Graham, Pelosi's daughter. They're all Swiss Templars, people. Okay? It's all a satanic, Luciferian, fucking Swiss Templar, bullet, bullshit, fallen angel, Palladian horseshit. The fucking angels are gonna save me! No, they're not! And YouTube, you are hypocrites because look, she says these things. Isn't that considered hate speech according to your standards? Huh? You guys are hypocrites. Look at this shit. You say that shit live on CNN Cartoon Network, but we all know what cartoon is worth. Fucking nothing, but they're owned by the, what, the elite? Give me a fucking break, people. They're all in bed with one another. Her, fucking uh, Lindsey Graham, Grijalva, and, you know, all this horse shit fucking lizard shit. All the change, and all these children are paid gang stalkers. They go to these places, you know, the kid walked away, he just handed him off. Not only that, I think he's a lizard. Look at that shit. Fucking handed the kid off. Yeah, you got Lindsey Graham gonna do a fucking, uh, session thing? Bullshit. All they're concerned about right now, people, is the fucking wall. And I've told you about the fucking wall. It's an illusion to blow fucking billions of trillions of dollars on stupid shit. They have technology that can jump you into a portal and you're in another fucking area. Go from point A to fucking point B. It's all bullshit. And the drugs are still going to come through via from the fucking drones or under the ground in their domes. So it's all bullshit. All the cartels are involved. All the House of Saud is involved. So let's get with it, huh?